We're at the, in the School of Chemistry and Molecular Biosciences at the University of Queensland. Our first main area of work focuses on making large molecules with holes in the middle of them that we can put smaller molecules inside. We can program exceptionally simple molecules to come together into things that are much more complex. Something like 15% of the world's energy production currently goes into the purification of industrial chemicals. And this is everything from purification of crude oil through to the safe manufacture of anti-cancer drugs, which are incredibly expensive. One of the reasons they're so expensive is because it's very hard to make things pure. My molecules will assist in the purification of drugs, amongst other things, which will drive down the cost of these life-saving medicines. The second area is involved in engineering new properties into crystals. Crystals underpin just about every electronic technology we use in our modern lives. Everything from interacting with radio waves to semi-conducting electronics relies on crystals. Crystals, they do really interesting things with electricity and light. The problem with crystals is they break when you bend them. What we've done is understood how and why some crystals can be appreciably more flexible than others. We've got some crystals now that are so flexible we can tie them in a knot. One of the things that's excellent about the Prime Minister's Prizes for Science is it sheds light on things that might otherwise stay in a laboratory. What I love about chemistry is being able to design something from first principles and get into the lab and make it. It's a little bit like a cross between playing with Lego and cooking.